Hey guys, I am Kalamusha, and today I'm going to be reviewing Kamen Rider Wizard Episode 32. Alright, let's talk about the visuals. Um, same as usual, there's only one complaint I have about this uh, episode, and that is when um, Haruto decides to uh, become little. He uses the, uh, I think it's the s small ring, and he turns into like a person like this big. And that looks just so stupid. Well, I mean, anytime like there's like a little tiny something on the screen, I don't know the the CG just turns horrible. I don't know what's up with that. But yeah, there's that little problem with the CG. Um, the sound, uh, same complaint as before. Whenever he turns small, his voice gets really weird. I pitched. That's about it. And uh, the opening's still good, and the background music at the end of the fight, I thought was actually pretty catchy, I liked it. That's about it there. Um, plot. Yeah, this is, uh, uh... If I knew this wasn't actually uh, leaving something else, I would say this would be almost a failure episode, but it ain't. But, yeah. It's uh, basically, um, God, what's his name? Uh, Manny's guy. I don't know why I keep uh, Naito. I think. Well, he meets his buddy uh, who is living in a little shack because he um, only wants to spend money on guitars, apparently. So he can go pay for a house or an apartment. So yeah, he lives in this little shack in the middle. I guess the park or something, I don't know, I'm not even sure where that is at, but, yeah, he lives there, and, basically, he finds a job where you can make one million yen a day, and, yeah, that's a lot of money, and, um, uh, it's actually a trap made by, a uh, gremlin, obviously, because he's the new guy in charge, really. And yeah, it's that's about it. Um, obviously, the, um, Ito's friend falls for the trap. Like every freaking gate that ever exists falls for traps that are made by phantoms. I don't know what's up with that, but yeah. Um, things I can say about this episode. Ito's friend's an idiot. Um. CG was kind of stupid in this one. Let's see what else. Uh, the Phantom was pretty creepy. His name was Hobgoblin. He was like, I'm not quite sure what, how to describe him, uh, but he was really creepy. Like, just bizarrely creepy. I mean, not his Phantom form, but his human form is creepy as hell. Um, his Phantom form is like a plant looking guy, but wasn't. It was kind of weird. He was kind of strong too, but, um, yeah, uh, I'll let you know that, uh, Infinity Mode kind of kicks his ass a, a wee bit. Let's see, anything else I can take? Um, I did think the part where I took, uh, his, uh, hair, well, not his hair, but, well, his hair did catch on fire, kind of, like, it turned into, like, an afro after he blew up, like, his, uh, Little campsite up by making just kebabs or something, and yeah, he fucked it up and he blew his um, little grill up and it burned his just kebabs and ruined his clothes and gave him a little effort. It was kind of funny. I was like, "Well, that's entertaining." Not much else I can say about it. That was probably about the only. Oh, actually, no. The best part about this episode is Gremlin. He actually, I'm starting to actually kind of like him in this, in this episode. Well, I'm mean, starting from this episode. Because he is a dick. When he's in charge, like, <laughs> he, he, like, goes up to Medu uh, Medusa after she's, like, doing stuff on her own and pissing off Gremlin. He makes, he gives her, um, his first order is, 
he takes a piece of gum out of his mouth, puts it in their hand, and says, go throw that away. You know, just a complete dick. But, I think that's, you know, better than his normal annoying self. He didn't quite do a annoying laugh this episode. He did it like once. And it wasn't nowhere near as like mind-blowing annoying. Let's see. Anything else we're going to talk about? No, not really. But next episode, Hobgoblin does some stuff. Because, yeah. Always a two-episode fight. Uh, I'm going to have to give the episode, though, a uh, 3.5 out of 5. Man, because uh, there wasn't too much for me to really like about the episode. I did like Gremlin in this episode at first. I liked the background music at the end, and I liked I to blown up because I was entertained. Everything else was just kind of meh. Um, I wasn't as impressed with this episode as all the other ones I've seen recently. So yeah, 3.5. Um, if you don't agree, let me know. If you do agree, still let me know. Also, thumbs up if you agree, if you disagree. Uh, you can thumbs down, you can do whatever. And make sure to uh, share the video and all that good stuff. Subscribe. Because I'll say that in every video. Might as well. Keep Keeps me from uh, having uh, to make up some other ending to my reviews. So later.